that I carry on with normal things. And you'd be amazed what is abnormal for her. One of the things I really do, she, she's following me, she's having a look, she's okay. But even something as simple, let's just see. Let's just see her reaction to this. Might sound strange. You see, she doesn't know what that is. She never experienced this chair moving. <laughs> you know, you've just got to keep giving her time. Now, much as people will be tempted with the old fashioned, awful traditional training, would be to make her sit. Make her sit. Stop her moving around. Never, never, never do that. Because dog's first and pre preferred choice of defence is to run away. So they want to be able to stay on their feet so they can take off in a moment. That, well, that is the first time she has chosen to put her bottom to the ground, SIT, whatever you want to call it. There is no request, and she's been here now nearly two hours. She's tired. Yeah, of course she is. She's taken so much in. It's, it's so draining for her, but never. I promise you, she, I, I don't know what she's been taught before, but the worst thing you can do to a dog like this is to make it sit or stay or lay down or anything. It must be able to retain the ability to get away in case something... See, this, this may seem simple to you and I, but to her, first time in a house, let alone sitting in a chair, she, if she stays on her feet, she feels safer, you make her sit down. This is why you never make them sit down at the curb or anything like that. For goodness sakes, you're out for a walk. You know, and you'll see why she won't be going out for any walks or anything. Got the key to the walk, nicely with good manners. But that's a few days down the line. These first couple of days are going to be just her and me. At least she's making a good association with me. Oh, you're such a good girl, aren't you? Who loves you, kid? She, I want her to realise that this hand only means affection or food. Not a bad start, is it, eh? And I don't expect it all to go smooth as silk. Come on, it's not going to happen. But I do kind of hmm, celebrate this little success. So again, never ask a dog to sit or to lay down when it is feeling stressed of any description. You know, people come to the door, leave it on its feet. Avoid ever asking for that because it's unnatural for them. Oh, good girl, I'm going to get some soup now. So I just carry on as normal. Remember, she, she doesn't know what any of this is. It's all alien to her. So she can, she can feel that she can run away or move away from something. That's just fine. 